realized the moment I fell into the fissure, the book would not be destroyed as I had planned. It continued falling into that starry expanse of which I had only a fleeting glimpse. I've tried to speculate where it might have landed, but I must admit that such conjecture is futile. Still, the questions about whose hands might one day hold my misbook are unsettling to me. I know my apprehensions might never be allayed, and so I close, realizing that perhaps the ending has not yet been written. Welcome back to Know It All DM Video Gaming. I'm Know It All DM, and today I am playing Mist. Now, this is actually called Real Mist, which is an updated version of the original uh, Mist game, and I. Uh, the original game wasn't in full 3D, it had still pictures, but the island so far looks pretty much identical. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to see what I can do. Now, Myst is a puzzle game that was created in the early 90s, or mid 90s, or something like that, and I played it ages ago. But, so, I, I don't remember anything about it, and I was a young kid, so, we're going to see what we can do looking around and, uh, figuring things out. So, I guess the first thing I need to do is come into the library here and, uh, take a look at, uh, what is this? Oh, it's just complete static. All right, well, what happens if we add the red page? Apparently he... Okay, whoever that is wants red pages. His name is Cirrus. Okay, so adding the page increased the message and made it more legible. Huh. Okay, so that one closes it and that one opens it. Okay, that's interesting. I will check that later after I put this page in here. Page 
ages. Never, never. Ages. I must have the blue page. Okay, so red book guy Cirrus wants red pages, and I don't know why I pointed at the painting. Red book guy wants red pages. Blue book guy over here wants blue pages. So and so, what do we have back here? Okay. Doesn't look like it can really do anything over here. At least not yet. Uh, looks like it's an elevator up somewhere. Is there a way to turn up the sensitivity on here? Um, tools. Mouse look speed. Okay. No, wait. Go back. I want this. So I can do... Okay. That's better. I have to right click to uh, get it where I can just turn left and right. And... Oh, look. It's a uh, map. Tower. Rotation. Okay, that's interesting. Um, the door is closed. Okay. So this is to open the door, which closes when the bookshelf opens, and then, okay. And what's in here? Um... Okay, that's... I sort of remember this from the old days. You have to build, make some sort of pattern on there and well, we won't know what the pattern is until we figure it out. Oh, hello. Can I? That's all. Door closed. What is this? Oh. Wait. It is. I can't 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 look up. That's weird. Maybe if I mouse to the top. No. Oh, there. Pull it down. There we go. All right. So that's. January through December, 1 through 31. Okay, that's the year from the year 1 to the year 9,999, and the time of day. That's pretty cool. And it accelerates the sky to that time. Okay, that's... I mean, it's an observatory. Whoa, that is actually really cool. All right, let's get over here and... Let's just turn the light back on for... Okay, so now what do we have over here? This is a gear thing. Oh, you have to physically move them. That's, that's, that's cool. I'm not sure. This, I think, opens up into some sort of thing. Just like the boat. The boat raises and lowers. But 
but it does it based on the uh, ship inside the this here. See how it's sunk under the water? If this were to get raised somehow, which I think is this puzzle here, because this changes from red to green, and you got to figure out. Okay, so I just, I don't hold the right click, I can just right click and it does it. Okay, and then down here we have a mine, or generators, is that what this is? And you want to get them okay interesting all right um okay and then there was the clock tower and then over here, there's this. Now this has something. Okay, so it's a combination thing. And okay, I've got to find my first clue as to what to do because I have no idea this looks like the picture in there and this I know you can rotate these things which are the hours and minutes and then press the button but I don't remember exactly what I'm supposed to do with that so um, now if I'm not mistaken somewhere okay rocket tower okay I've got to get power to the rocket I've got to do something but I don't remember what I think it first has something to do with the ship and possibly this down here um okay I am only slightly I can't close that slightly confused now the first time I played the original mist it took me ages to figure out what to do oh hold on I think that should activate something there like that ha should have something to do with something over here maybe um no okay because i know Rotating the tower has the tower looking at things, but if I can't figure out how to get into the uh, tower, maybe I can read some of these books. That's something I didn't think about, Rope. Let me let me just see if any of these books have any. No. 
No, I... Oh, hello. Okay. There are pictures and a story. That's right. This game had a lot of reading in it. Um, all right. There's the first book. Whoa, different colored ink. Uh, the one that I am looking for... That's the rocket ship. I want to find... Oh, that's, that's still that one. Uh... That was Rhyme. Okay, let's just start with the green one. Which is... I have called this age Channel Wood. And it is a very different world. Though it is exactly how I imagined it, it is still amazing to see it with my own eyes. Water covers this age as right. far as I can... This is a really awesome game but it uh requires a lot of reading okay um so i don't know exactly what's going on there but okay so oh i can Hold it and rotate it. I want it to go here. No, I want it to go... Why, why does it not stop on that, I wonder? Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. Looking at that, anything? Can I flip the switch? No? Okay. Um, I'm going to play around in this a while, read some of the books. Oh, there's a note. Catherine, I left a message of utmost importance in our four chamber beside the dock. Enter the number of marker switches on this island into the imager to retrieve the message. Okay. The number of switches. Okay. So, enter the number of switches in the... Oh, there's a... I can just open the door. That That's interesting. Number of switches into the... numerical something or another okay I don't get it there's no numerical anything um, it says enter the number of, of marker switches into the numerical slider uh, into the Oh, that's not. Imager. Into the imager to retrieve the message. Well, okay, let's uh, count. Uh, let me start on this side of the island. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like there are eight marker switches. So, enter the number of marker switches into the into, in, imager. I don't see anything. Um, I 
Okay, well, I am... Wait, what is this? Settings. Oh, hello. Does that do it? tell me anything that I didn't already know except for plot. So this guy's sons, Cirrus and Aknar, which are the two in the books, at least I know Cirrus is, I assume Aknar is the other one. Um, the ones, yeah, um, she said remember, or he said Remember the tower rotation. Well, I've been trying to rotate this thing and get things to work, but unless I can find a way into this, I mean... Oh, I can actually push the, the thing. Okay. There we go. Well, that's a lot easier. Okay. Um, okay, so the tower rotation is... Okay, here are some dates, and we know that the dates can be entered into the, uh, the observatory. So, let me uh, get something to write these dates down on. Alright, October 11th. 1984. At 10.04 a.m. January 17th, 12.07 at 5.46 a.m. November 23rd, 97.91 was at 6.57 p.m. <laughs> All right, well, let's see what this gives us uh, in the observatory. And it says that is a key, and being that I... I... Being that I rotated it to, what is that rotation? That is toward the boat. Is that the boat? That's the dock, yeah. Um, so let's just see what we can do with, um, can I get out please? Thank you. These dates. Oh, 
Alright, come in, close the door, lights off, alright. Pull this down, alright. That is... The first one was October 11th. Nineteen eighty four. At ten o four AM. Okay. And we get what appears to be a leaf of some sort. Okay. Next is January 17th, 12.07 at 5.46 a.m. Alright, and that, I don't know what that looks like, but I'm going to sort of draw it. Okay, you got the three dots at the top, you got... Okay. And then finally, we've got... November... 23rd... 9791... Good year, by the way. Um, at 6.57 p.m. And I don't know what that's supposed to be either. Uh, blop, 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 blop. All right, got that drawn. All right, now this is all at the boat so maybe I can do something with the boat although this I think is referring to these so because I saw the leaf all right green and then that other thing I it's not an arrow uh, the anchor could be the last. It wasn't a, second one wasn't a bug or a snake or an eye. Could it have been that thing? Probably not. Let me go check that again. Well, I mean, what, what does that second one look like to you? Um, let's close the door, turn the lights off, and look at that second one again. That second one was January 17th, 12.07 at 5.46. AM. Okay. It's got three dots there. I mean, what it it might be a snake, I guess. But I'm not positive if does the snake start in the top left and Okay, maybe. So we're going to do snake. And I think that last one was an anchor. Do you do anything? No. Um, maybe that last one wasn't an anchor. 
Uh, okay, off. Um, what could that last one have been if not an anchor? Could it have been a bird or an eye? Or a bug? It might have been the bug. Oh, I hear something. The boat is rising! Not entirely sure what these switches are for. But, so the boat has risen. And the boat has risen! Okay. Um, can I get on the boat? Uh, what happens if I... No, I have no idea. Well, I... Oh, there we go. Haha. -ha. I am on the boat. And what do we have? A, a book. Okay. Um, what's in this book? Uh, an island in a storm. And I'm teleporting to the island. Well, that, that was, okay, so the boat can't go down there. Um, this place looks flooded. So I can't go anywhere that's flooded. I can go across here to three buttons, but I can only have one press at a time. And the buttons just reset, didn't they? Okay. So, what about over to the lighthouse? Oh. There's a key. Remember we used the key to get here, so and there's a lock. So we've got to somehow get the key to the lock. If I remember correctly, this platform will raise up to there so that the key will unlock it. But in order to get that to happen, what do we have to do? This is kind of weird. The boat goes in that way and out this way. Uh, can I come this way? I can come this way. Okay. So it's not so much flooded as something else weird. Uh, this is really, really... Um, what? Can I press the button? Oh, there we go. Door opens and... Okay, that is really, really creepy. A rib cage with... Can I do anything with it? I don't think so. Mask. Ooh. A rose. That becomes a skull. Rose to skull. Okay. That's a map. More maps. So this is some sort of seafarer's thing. Ooh, what is that? Marker sweet. The vault is located. The island of achieved very. Instructions are each of the marker Oh, this has something to do with the original island. Uh, that was this one. That has something to do with the marker switches. If I could only find the other half of that note. Oh, 
I got a blue page. I guess I should take this blue page back to uh, Aknar. What do you guys think? Because uh, the guy who I uh, who was in the message said he suspected one of his sons, probably Aknar, but he's not going to leap to conclusions. Well, but how do I get back? That's the question. What happens if I... Okay. Oh, now that one's water-filled. Okay. I think I know what is going on with that. Um... That's interesting. I can't look up or down, but I can look around. Interesting. Okay, so... Um, but the, that pump seems to pump things, pump water in and out of places. Um, the one on the right doesn't seem to actually... Unless it pumped it out of here, which it did. So now I can actually come down here and see what's in here. Let the water out of that. And then when I raise the water again, the chest will be up. Okay, do you unlock the chest uh, can I get up here please you unlock the oh I can just do that uh, you unlock the chest with the key not that lock up there so what I need to do now is that which should not only raise that but it should bring the no it doesn't get the water out of there Okay, um, it's not what I thought would happen, uh, but it did get the water out from here. Okay, so let's go see what the, did the chest not come up? Um, maybe I have to reclose that valve after the water's drained. Uh, let's go back down there and see. it and now will the chest float or is there something else that I have not yet done that I still need to do uh, I think I need to go and check what's in there but I don't know how to get the pump to depump from in there Oh, there it is. That's weird. So I could have swore I already pushed that button. Alright, so what's down here? A red room. Oh. This must be Cirrus's room. Cirrus had decent tastes, apparently. What was that? Was that a red page? Uh, 
Okay. I was actually hoping. Whoa. That's interesting. I was actually hoping he would have the uh, other half of that letter that we saw. But he does not seem to. So I now have the red page instead of the blue page. Is that correct? And then let's see if that chest is floating now. Yes. Okay. So now I should be able to use that to unlock this. And inside here is the key to unlock that. And then I can open the door and go up the steps. All right, so what is in here? A generator. And batteries. Okay, so let's see what happens when I charge up the batteries. Okay, batteries are charged. Um, oh, that turns the lights on. Okay, so both of these are empty now. Okay, so I can only hold one page at a time. I can take the red page or the blue page. I think I can come back and do both. But this... This is just creepy. So what happens if... And you see, I don't know... Whoa! There's a secret entrance. Okay. Um, okay, I'm now underwater. Um, okay, so it looks like both of these, you see, this is the red room. So there's a tunnel between the two that leads to the, oh. Hold on. There was a comp that was a compass, not just a thing with a bunch of lights. So if I reactivate the generator, which should reactivate that room. See, because that just drained the battery. And then look in the, uh, the, the telescope thing up top and see if I can find the rotation of something or the, the angle of that 135 so I need to go into the secret passageway which should be here and 135 if I light that up 
Ooh. But how do I know the numbers? There are no numbers. All right, well, that's north. So, what I need to do is find not the number, but the... Wait, is that 135 degrees? Maybe. And if north is zero, then I need to... Yeah, 350. So, 135 degrees. If those pips in the secret passage are... Uh, okay, let's see if we can figure this out real quick. All right, that's north, that's zero. So 135, that's 345, I guess. Uh, so there are 32 lights. Uh, so, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. That doesn't make sense because that's 180 down here. So if that's 180, I'm looking for 135. 90 and 80. Uh, 135 should be... What would 135 okay. be? So I used the calculator and got some calculations done. So I should need to go 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And it's on. Not entirely sure what I did, but it, 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 it's on. Um... That's just a spinny thing. I can spinny thing that too. Um, not sure what clicking that actually did, but I clicked the right one, I think. Um, did anything happen up here? No. Did anything happen in the front of the boat? Not that I can see. Well, I don't know what clicking that um, clicky page thing di did. This is water filled. So I need to left pump to dewaterfy this. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, that's how I get home. Okay. I'm not entirely sure what that room that I lit up did, but... Now, does that remove the water from here? Yes. Okay. 
Let me double check that that light up room thing. All right, so I clicked the thing, the room lit up. But I'm not entirely sure what the point of doing that was. I mean, I am extremely confused about that. Okay. So which page should I take back? I'm just gonna take the red page back, then come back and take the creepy skull. Take the red page back because he, he looked nicer. Then I'm going to take the blue page back and see what he has to say. And I'm pretty much going to do that for each of, I guess they call them ages, the worlds that we teleport to. I am wondering though, I lit up the lighthouse, okay? Not entirely sure what the entire point of that was, clicking the bulb in there, but I'm sure I will eventually figure that out. <laughs> I can walk over the hole. Okay, so maybe if I look through the uh, telescope one last time before I leave, I'll figure it out. There's that at 135. I have no idea. But whatever we did, let's head home. And by home, I mean back to the Island of Mist. Oh, I've got to push the button. Now, if I push this button, that drains that and this button drains the boat okay head back to mist So I'm in the library. Sounds addicted. Don't waste time. Page to me. 
All right, well, he wants me to bring red pages and not blue pages and claims to be wrongfully imprisoned. Well, most people who claim to be wrongfully imprisoned, that's awesome. It's night. Um, most people who claim to be wrongfully imprisoned are not wrongfully imprisoned. So I'm going to get the blue page and listen to this. I'm going to go grab it off screen and then let you hear the message from this one. And then that'll be it for the episode. I got the blue page. My brother, I beg you. To be complete. Always blue pages. Listen to him. Now listen to my brother. An egotistical fool and a liar. Bring me the blue pages. Don't bring the red ones. I've been wrongfully imprisoned. You must be. I will have my retribution. Please bring me the blue pages. Blue pages. 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 All right, well, looks like they both are begging me not to trust the other and to bring their own color pages. So what I'm going to do is I am going to leave it up to you guys. Which one do you want me to get? Now, each episode, I will take a look at the previous episode and look at the comments. And if you have red or blue as the most commented, I will get that color of page and not the other. And if I have an even number, I will get both. And you can also vote for both. And if both outnumbers both red and blue, then I will get both. If I don't get any votes, I'm going to get both anyway. So that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, if you did, hit that like button and leave a comment. And, uh, yeah, so, as always, I'm Know-It-All DM, and I hope you're enjoying the new series. And, uh, yeah, y'all have a good day now. Yeah.